Hi, welcome back. In this video, we will see what is the usage of um, uh, session command that is present in um, uh, Cypress. Okay. How it will uh, uh, help us uh, uh, in reducing uh, uh, reducing a time uh, while executing um, uh, our tests. Okay. So suppose uh, uh, I'm I'm creating a, a test. Okay. Here uh, I'm creating a test uh, spec file with um, uh, login with uh, session dot cy dot js. Okay, so describe login with session. So as usual, I'm going to uh, create a before each hook, and then I'm going to uh, log into the application. So in my previous video, I have shown you how we can use a, a we can create a custom command and use that custom command in before each. So in this case, I'm using cy dot login, and then I'm sending uh, passing a username and uh, password as parameters so if you see the commands.js that is present in support i have created a, a custom command called login okay and after that um, uh, let's assume um, i'm having um, uh, 10 test cases uh, 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 5 to 10 test cases okay test case 1 and um, so in this example i'm not um, uh, doing anything uh, here so I'm just uh, uh, what I will do is I will uh, log I log the statement okay test case uh, one okay so like this say suppose if I'm having uh, five test cases uh, don't go for ten ten uh, five test cases test case three Test case four. Five and then test case five. See if you run um, uh, this test case uh, test suit file uh, login with session. So we got a login page and then executed it. And again, second time also we got a login page. Now third time we got a login page. Fourth time for fourth test case, and fifth time also we got a login page. Okay. If you see uh, to execute this all five test cases, there is um, we haven't written um, uh, much code in this all test cases till it took um, uh, fourteen uh, seconds to execute. Um, uh, uh, these five test cases okay so but uh, in each test whenever we are uh, executing these test cases for each test case it's uh, navigated to login page and uh, it's logged in every time so we can avoid um, uh, this uh, every time logging for each test case in a single spec file uh, by using this uh, session uh, command okay see le let uh, see uh, remember this uh, it took 14 seconds um, uh, to execute these five test cases how we can uh, reduce this time uh, by using this session command we will see here okay so for that what i am going to do is uh, i am going to create another um, uh, custom command um, uh, in commands um, where i am uh, naming it as um, login with session okay so i am renaming it as login with uh, session so after that um, um, in this command we are going to get um, a username and password because we need that um, uh, to log into the application after that uh, there is a command cy dot session okay i am going to use that one here here we need to provide a name uh, for this session so what i am doing is i am providing so we need to provide a name to this session so i am providing a name as the combination of uh, this username and uh, password okay 
and as a uh, second argument uh, we need to pass a uh, arrow function in this arrow function what i am going to do is i am going to write uh, the login functionality okay so it's usual as i uh, it takes username and password okay so after this uh, what we need to do is uh, after successful login we need to visit the first page uh, landing page uh, here so for that what i am going to do is uh, i am going to write uh, uh, cy dot visit and then i am providing uh, my url of the dashboard because this is the uh, uh, landing page that we uh, that we want to visit so i'm i'm adding this page in before each hook and uh, that that we need to add after login okay so if i save this and then uh, if you go to uh, application uh, okay it is as previous one because i haven't updated this uh, cy dot login with cy dot uh, login with session okay so even now if you see it took uh, the second time when i ran i took uh, 17 uh, seconds okay so now i am uh, logging with uh, uh, now i am uh, now i am trying this with login with session command that we have uh, uh, created right now and i am saving it and i am saving the file uh, here as well okay and after that let's uh, navigate to the page see uh, it took just um, uh, seven seconds um, uh, to complete uh, all the five test cases and if you observe again this login page uh, will get only one time we will not get the login page for all the uh, five test cases so i'm rerunning the tests again okay right now it is not even appearing because uh, if you see the first test case it's cached uh, uh, all these session values so i am clearing all the sessions and now we will get this uh, login page first time and then from the second test cases we don't get those uh, that login page okay see now now it got executed in um, uh, six seconds so if you wanted to rerun this test case you can rerun it but uh, you don't get that uh, login page again uh, when you are rerunning the tests okay so it already if you see it already got cached in the session so if you clear the session then only that login page will be executed okay so in this way we can uh, uh, save the time uh, by using um, uh, session command uh, okay so this is very useful uh, and uh, yeah uh, we should uh, start using this um, uh, cy dot session uh, it will save a lot of time uh, while executing a uh, uh, test if you have multiple test cases uh, uh, in your project okay thank you